Here we have the man, the myth, the legend, oh, man. Ben Peterson from Blade HQ. And we're going to find out. Ben, be honest with me. This is off yeah. camera. Actually, it's on camera. But oh, we're rolling. Of all, nobody's seen more knives than you. What is your favorite knife in the whole world, Ben? Right now, see, this is the funny thing about my favorite knife is it, it fluctuates according to the situation. But right now, I have this Benchmade sequel from SHOT Show 2017 that I just love. It's got an axis lock, aluminum handle, it's in bend blue, and it just does it for me. It's, it's got that nice finger right at the end of my finger blade. Mm, it's good. Now Ben, I know you're here because it's your job. Do yeah. you get to walk around and share the joy of the experience or do you have to stay at a table? I walk around like this. I, I, I almost run walk around simply because I just, this is work for me, it's fun work, but I just have a lot to do, there's a lot going on. Like right now, I'm handing out peach stickers because everybody needs a peach sticker, right? Right, right. And then at 12.30 today, we got a Bally Song competition. So it's like, you just got to run. So sometimes I get to walk the floor, but for the most part now, it's just like ping, ping, ping. So Cool, Ben. Well, enjoy yeah. the rest of Blade. Thank you, man. Good to meet you. Well, here we are, our second day in Blade, and what's your name? I'm Hunter Lutzford. And where are you from, Hunter? Huh? Alabama. And what is your favorite knife maker? Um, I like um, Jeff Wovel, Tough Knives. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he's not going to be here. Do you own one of his knives? I don't. Do you hope to go in and buy one today? Um, he's not going to be here, unfortunately, but, yeah. If you could go inside and buy a knife, what would you buy? Probably a uh, Brad Southern Tolk. Ooh, the Tolk or the Mini Tolk? Yes, sir. Okay. Well, enjoy your experience. All right. Thank you. Here we are at Blade Show 2018. We got a guy here, and what's your name? Wayne Markle. And where are you from, Wayne? Florida. And you saw yesterday, what is your favorite knife maker here at Blade? Jerry Fisk. Oh, yeah? What kind of blades does Jerry make? He makes folders. And what do you like about his knives? I, I, he's got some good knives. I just like his uh, pocket knives. They, uh, and uh, I'm a fanatic about pocket knives. They, uh, I've loved pocket knives ever since I've been a little kid. And I've collected all kinds of pocket knives. Now, do you own a Fisk knife? Uh, no, that I don't. Uh, they're a little too expensive for me. I got it. They, uh, but I just like them. It's like a museum, though. You like come and look at it. I come and look at all the different knives here. There, you've got a lot of good different makers here, and uh, I just like looking at all of them. They, uh, I can't remember all of the different makers here, but you got some uh, fantastic different makers here. And, okay. uh, I, I like the folders. I like uh, the big long ones. I like um, Skinners. I like them all. All right. And I collect knives. I, I've got all kinds at home. So. Well, thank you for your time and enjoy uh, the rest of Blade. I'm going to. Okay, here we are, second day of Blade, and what's your name? My name's Mark. I'm from uh, Athens, Georgia. All right, and what is your favorite maker, Mark? Without a doubt, it's LT Wright. They are putting out some of the best quality stuff out there. Customer service is second to none. Uh, they've got their own Kydex shop. They've got their own leather shop in-house. They take special orders. Fantastic products. All right, well, enjoy the rest of Blade. Will do. Thanks, Nick. We're in the second day of Blade, and uh, we got somebody here. What's your name? Larry McKinney. Where are you from, Larry? Oxford, Mississippi. All right, and what did you buy yesterday? Uh, do I now? What knife did you buy yesterday, the first bought, day of Blade? Uh, uh, Dark Timber Honey Badger. Ha honey Badger. Yeah. Dark Timber has a cult following. It's like a community. What do you like best about Dark Timber? Uh, well, I like the style and the function of his knives. He also, like I said, it has a brotherhood, the Dark Timber Brotherhood. So, I like that following also. All right. Well, enjoy the rest of Blade. All right. Thank you. All right. We're on the second day of Blade Show here. What's your name? Norman Coletti. Norman, where are you from? Atlanta, Georgia. What is your favorite knife maker, Norman? Well, I'm more of a production knife kind of guy. I like the Benchmades and the Columbia Rivers and that kind of stuff. Just regular knives. All right. What are you looking to get out of today in the inside the show? Well, just looking to see a lot of really cool custom knives, some solid craftsmanship, and maybe some tools that I haven't seen before. That kind of stuff. All right. Well, enjoy the rest of Blade. Thanks. Here we are at the second day of Blade, and what's your name? Chase. Chase, where are you from? Maryland. 
And what are you hoping to get out of the show inside there today? Um, I'm a Peter Kohler fan all the way, so, you know, Dark Timber Knife. Dark Timber, you know Dark Timber, some of the most rabid fans available. Yeah, I missed out yesterday, they had that whole group meeting. I didn't make it yesterday, I had to work, but I See, mean. You're part of the Brotherhood then? Yeah. All right, well enjoy your show today. All right. Uh, Here we are, the second day in the Blade, what's your name? Robbie Langford. Where are you from, Robbie? Brandon, Mississippi. And what are you hoping to get out of going inside the Blade today? Uh, looking at different types of handle materials, leather, supplies, things like that. Supplies, mainly. So you're a maker? I am a maker. All right. Do you make fixed or folders? Fixed. All right. Well, I hope you get what you need today. Thank you. All right. Where are you from? Marion, North Carolina. All right. What kind of knife would you love to find inside today? Something from Vehement would be really nice. Oh, yeah? What's your favorite Vehement model? Uh, I'm not really sure. You just like the maker? I just like the maker. I've looked at a lot of their different stuff. Okay, best wishes inside. Thank you. All right, where are you from? Mary, North Carolina. All right, what do you hope to find inside today? Uh, I don't know. Just, I want to see everything. Want to see everything? Yeah. All right, well, best wishes. Appreciate it. All right, what's your name? Steve Bisher. And where are you from, Steve? I live in Cumming, Georgia. All right, what is your favorite knife maker? Probably Zero Tolerance. And what knife would you love to find inside today to buy? Well, I know a custom knife maker, and uh, I'm looking for a um, general knife that's got wooden handles on it, and uh, this wood comes out of the rivers in South Carolina. Oh, yeah? What kind of wood is that? It's Sinker Cypress. Well, and who's the maker who uses it? Lee Tigner with Old Town Cutlery. All right. Sounds like a great knife. Thanks for the interview. You're welcome. All right. What's your name? Ashley Young. Where are you from, Ashley? I'm from uh, LaGrange, Georgia. All right. Now, you're in Blade for the first time this year. What do you hope to get out of going inside there? I came this year because a bunch of my friends uh, got me to go. So, first time show, so I came for the people. And I'm really interested in seeing a lot of the tools these knife makers use on how it's done. Um, so, uh, and that's, that's the main reason I came. Cool. Well, enjoy your experience. All right. Thank you.